The documentary, Making a Murderer, left out several facts. I'm here to set the record straight. Blood was found in six different places in Teresa's car, deposited in several different ways, including by gravity, but also by contact transfers. If blood was planted, it wouldn't have been deposited in so many different ways. Viewers were shown a purple-topped blood tube. It was presented as if it was tampered with. In reality, a hole in the top is how the blood gets into the vial of blood. A nurse would have testified if needed. Teresa's car key was found in Stephen Avery's bedroom. The documentary made it seem like the key was planted. They suggested that it wasn't found until the sixth or seventh search. In reality, this key was found on the first thorough search of the bedroom. Both the defense and the documentary theorized that Teresa's bones may have been burned someplace else and planted at the burn pit area. That doesn't make sense because of the frail nature of the bones. Certain editing tactics like cherry picking or omissions, it seemed as if the documentary fabricated the truth.